education is an indispensable sector of development in any society. To boost the level of educational development and raise literacy rates in the local government, the leadership distributed 400 GCE forms to indigent students. The council chairman, Kendi Almoru Foloyede, said the exercise aims to ease financial burden and guidance of the recipients, adding that other educational support schemes are well on the way. It is important to know that it is part of our educational support program, which aims at improving literacy in Noshobi and meeting the needs of students who are willing to learn but whose parents cannot afford to buy the forms for their children and words. Therefore, our objective is bringing governance closer to the grassroots and addressing some of the economic challenges facing our people. Education, as we all know, is the tool that breaks down all barriers. It is an instrument of socialization for a child to be fully integrated into the society. And why we are here today, our administration will also provide other free educational support for indigenous students to aid their learning ability. I therefore implore all the beneficiaries of today's program to encourage us to do more by preparing well, studying hard to justify this opportunity given to you, and the funds spent on procuring these forms by coming out in flying colors, in Jesus' name. Amen. The students appreciated the leadership for the gesture and promised to utilize the opportunity. I am here because of the shaman give us the opportunity for the GCE form. No, I know that my parents did not have the money because actually the first place I went to, they said everything together with the form, they said 40,000. So my parents was like, I should not bother to do GCE. And my work results actually had problem. So that's why I'm here because it gave me the opportunity to, to be here, to, to further my education because my parents does not have the money to provide, to allow me to further my education. I'm very grateful for what he has done to me today. Not, I'm not even the only one. There are a lot of students in the air appreciating what he has done to us today. He gave us a free GCE form because almost every one of us know that not all our parents can afford this. And it is even very scarce, very rare to see a man that can do such a thing like this. I'm, I really appreciate what he has done today. And I'm making, I'm making this promise that with this GCE form, I will achieve more greater things in the future. And I will never forget the good things they have done to me. Because no matter what, there will always be a remembrance that, wow, this man has done a great thing in my life. I just want to wish them that uh, they should all see this as an opportunity to go higher in the future. Not to see it as a kind of, uh, will I use it to the bad language, that they will talk about in Yamuningbe, don't let them see it like that. I want them to see it as an opportunity that should be exploited and make them a great person and deserve the learner in future. That we increase their knowledge and give them the ability to further their education into the higher institution. Alumaru Fuloyede further said the exercise is part of the multi sector intervention rolled out to cushion the effects of the subsidy removal. He admonished students to always prioritize their education for academic excellence. It's for them to be upright. They should read their books. They should focus on education because education breaks all barriers. Um, with education, you are assured of your future uh, economically. So I will appeal and um, suggest uh, and pray that they come out in flying colors so that all the money expended on this will not go in vain. The exercise is a demonstration of Oshodi Solo Council's leadership responsiveness to the yearnings of residents. Thank you.